How's this for Thanksgiving dessert? Chocolate dipped strawberries that look like roasted turkeys. Let's see what's cooking. Let's get the facts. Let's see what's cooking. It's time for yo yo max 12. Hello, everyone. Starting off with some strawberries, of course. Wash the strawberries and pat them dry, and they're best if they're at room temperature. And if you can find like the heart-shaped ones, the large ones, those are best, but any kind of strawberry would be fine. You'll also need some little caramels. Now these are the, just the little wrapped ones that you can buy. Put them in the microwave for three or four seconds just to soften them up a bit so that you can mold them. Then you'll need some pretzel sticks. Now you'll take a piece of caramel and you're going to mold it around the end of one of the pretzel sticks. Now this is going to be the top part of the turkey leg and the size of it will depend on the size of strawberry that you have of course. And that pretzel stick is clearly too long so what we're going to do is we're going to just measure it up against the strawberry. You just want just a little bit of the turkey leg sticking out the bottom so all you have to do is just break off a piece of the pretzel stick. Super easy. Just like that. Now to glue this turkey leg to the strawberry body, you just dip it into some chocolate, press and hold until it's stuck. Won't have to hold too long. And then do the same thing with the other side and then just put them in the refrigerator if you need to, just to let that chocolate harden completely. Now to make them easier to dip, I stuck a couple of toothpicks at the end of the strawberry. And now it's time to dip. You can use uh, plain old semi-sweet chocolate, whatever you want. You can also use those melted candy melting wafers as well, the, co the chocolate coating. And then just dip it in gently. Now I had a piece of chocolate that wasn't melted in there, so I just kind of stuck that off and then re-dipped it just to make sure it was nice and smooth. And then you're gonna let the excess drip off, just gently, very gently shake. And then if you need to, you can just scrape the bottom of the turkey on the edge of the container, just like that. And then put it onto some wax paper or a silicone mat to harden. And there is a little turkey. Now, just because this is so satisfying to do, I'm just amazed at how you start off with these pretzels and a strawberry. And then when you dip it, it looks so much like a little roasted turkey. There we go. Another one. Oh, lost a toothpick there. That's okay. So I had one left. You can also use these little those thin uh, skewers, wooden skewers. That would work too. And there they are all on a plate. You could put some fresh strawberries kind of around them if you wanted to. And wouldn't this be an awesome little dessert for Thanksgiving, especially when you've had a huge meal and uh, you're really not that hungry for a huge dessert. This is a really nice little dessert that I think everyone will get a kick out of and will love. Thanks for watching. I know this is hard to believe, but I have an entire playlist full of chocolate dipped strawberries in different colors and different themes. If you want to see any of these videos, click on your screen or click on the top right hand corner, which will have the playlist. Thanks for watching.